the stair with East Woodland Survival. Uh, kind of out prowling around today. Thought I'd run over to Fort Loudon. Uh, kind of show you around a little bit. This is a fort that was built. It's about 1750s. Here's the lake. You can kind of see it sets out on this little peninsula here. So let's go up to the visitor center and then go check out the fort. This is kind of cool. A little bit of everything in here. Some of the things they found at the fort. <laughs> this is a good old flint box. Brown Bess, 1732. Now that thing is massive. Call a wall gun. Thing is huge. It's, uh, 1744. Just for scale, if you look, that's my hand. For scale, that thing's huge. Okay, we'll head over to the fort. Fort Loudon, constructed by the English, 1756, to help win the valley of the Mississippi uh, captured by the Indians under French influence in 1760. This is U.S. Uh, Army Fort in the Cherokee Nation. The ruins visible across the lake are those of the Teleco blockhouse built by the young U.S. government 34 years after the fall of Fort Loudon. Now here's how across the lake. That's the uh, what remains of the blockhouse. If I can zoom in there. That's the old Teleco blockhouse. You can barely see some of the remains there.
these are already the cartridges and shot. This is kind of cool. It's the Smoky Mountains. Beautiful view. It's a bunkhouse. I got an oven. Love to build one of these actually. It's pretty awesome. It's been used recently. It's still warm. Another bunkhouse. Black Smithy. Pretty cool forge. Good rope bed. Which are not too bad actually. I've slept on one before. Some reenactors. This is the storehouse. Yeah, honey locust. Look at these puppies. You want to see these barbs? So they planted this to try to keep people from coming in. Pretty nasty stuff. And a lot of times you get hit with one of those or you get one stuck and uh, it leaves a pretty nasty festering kind of uh, wound for a few days. Hurts like crazy. It's got a really 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 pretty uh, view out here looks like I got some river cane got like a little moat I'd actually heard of uh, the Cherokee planting like uh, a lot of stuff around their camps like uh, planting things such as blackberry and rose and thorny bushes and things around their camp uh, keep animals and people out so this looks like a recreation of a Cherokee top structure so I headed back into the fort I got junior junior Rangers or something going on today so this is a pretty interesting thing pretty wicked to run up on that with a horse hard to get across That's pretty awesome.
Alright, here's the string of houses up through here. It's kind of cool. Just looks like barracks or block house, bunk houses. Yeah, that's what it is. Barrack, block house, bunks. So guys, if you're ever in Vaughn or Tennessee, stop by, check out Fort Loudon. It's uh, actually pretty cool. Got a lot of history here. Looks like it's one of the first forts built um, in this area, 1750s. So, built by the British. And Cherokee attacked, run everybody off, uh, laid siege to it for a while. And uh, so, uh, we're going to head back out. This is Darren, these woodland survival. Thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the woods.